Welcome to the MWRA's Wastewater Treatment Plant on Deer Island. This plant houses some pretty impressive treatment innovations and serves 2.55 million people, including the city of Boston. They also have an amazing education program, so we figured it's the perfect place to bring a bunch of kids and see what they really know about the wastewater treatment process. My first question to you, and this is a very serious question, what happens after you flush? Where does it go? Into the sewer. Into the sewer. They go down pipes and they lead here. Is it better to treat wastewater or to not treat wastewater? Treat, treat it. With the like if you don't treat the water, then like all sorts of harmful bacteria enters the ocean and could like harm the fish. To like get out all the bacteria that could make humans sick if it's near us. I think that they might have to boil it because boiling water um, would kill some of the bacteria. They could build a robot to get all the bacteria out. What about good bacteria? Do you think there's good bacteria in your body that helps fight off colds? Do you think there's good bacteria at wastewater plants? No. Yes. Um, yes. Who says yes? Raise your hand. Who says no? I think yes because we couldn't treat the whole wastewater without like something else. You guys are pretty smart. How many gallons per day come here? 200. Seven. Seven, seven gallons per day, okay. Thousand and ten. Do you guys want to know the answer? Yeah. yeah. 350 million gallons. So I guess seven. How many of you take science class? Raise your hand. How many of you learn about wastewater treatment in your science class? They don't teach that. How many of you want to learn more about wastewater treatment in your science class? How many of you want to work at a wastewater plant when you grow up? Well, if I didn't have to, like, be in, like, the same environment as it, like, I wouldn't have to smell it and be like, ew, this is gross. I'm being surrounded by poop. I think it's great to be surrounded by poop. I want to be an engineer, a chemist, and a writer. And this is engineering, and it is pretty cool, but it's also pretty disgusting. Not bad. Now the kids will get the real facts from the MWRA's Education Program Manager, Meg Tabasco. Meg's been developing and teaching this program for 30 years, so she really knows what she's doing. Next, they'll see the plant up close with Lenny Young, the Facilities Manager for the Deer Island plant. Lenny has been with the MWRA for decades, so the kids are getting the goods from a true expert. All right, so how many of you guys are now thinking it would be pretty cool to work at a wastewater treatment facility or in the water quality industry? And what's the first thing that happens when the wastewater gets to the plant? And what does it, what does it remove? The yeah, like jewelry. What are those big eggs that are right behind us over there? Digesters. And what do they do? They, they boil the sludge, so they take methane gas the out of it and they make fertilizer. So what do you think is the most important thing that a that, uh, uh, wastewater plant does? It makes it so that like, we can have a bunch of water to go around, so that like, water gets sent out to the ocean and then the ocean water evaporates and and um, then we get our water from that and then we drink it and then it just goes around and around and around and around. It definitely makes our lives a lot easier because we don't have to worry too much about the bacteria in our water. If there's one thing that you're going to tell your friends about when you go home, um, what do you think you'd tell them? Like, a lot happens when you flush the toilet, like more than you think. Like, I tell them, like, have a nice journey. So are you guys happy that the MWRA Deer Island facility is here? Yes, yes definitely. The last thing we're going to do today is everyone's going to have to take a dunk in the in the wastewater treatment process, okay? Yes! Yes! Yeah. <laughs> Aw, Anthony was just joking. I think. Thanks for spending the day with us, kids. We hope you learned a lot. 